Hello, Brian Knowlton back with another super cool slide reel tutorial. In this tutorial, we will learn how to convert watts and resistance to amps using the Ohm's Law Wheel. If you have a super cool slide rule, get it out, turn it over to the back. We will be using this equation here. For this example, I will use 2880 watts at a resistance of 20 ohms. Let's substitute these values in our equation. Replace the P with watts of 2880. Replace the R with the resistance of 20. This symbol here is called a radical. A radical means we must take the square root of the number inside. To obtain the square root, we must determine what number, when multiplied by itself, is equal to this number. But first we must perform the operation inside. Divide 2880 by 20. This gives us 144. The square root of 144 is 12. If you do not have a calculator, the easiest way to calculate a square root is trial and error. Start with 10 times 10, which is 100. This is not large enough. We know that the number, we know the number must be larger than 10, so let's try 12. 12 times 12 equals 144, sure enough. So 2,880 watts with a resistance of 20 ohms should equal 12 amps. This concludes our tutorial, but please stay tuned while we introduce you to the super cool slide rule. This is the most useful tool in the HVAC industry. It's guaranteed to save you lots of money by saving you lots of time. Thanks for watching. Hello. I'd like to take a minute to introduce you to the coolest tool in the HVAC industry. Historically, technicians have carried four or five different slide rules. You have one for R22, one for R410A, one for metal duct sizing, one for flexible duct sizing, and yet others for diagnostics or troubleshooting. Thankfully, those days are gone. This one tool will allow you to charge a system with R22 or R410A and either the superheat or subcooling method the back cover contains required formulas, it has capacitors, rules, and practices, a wet bulb conversion chart, how to perform computations on series or parallel circuits, an electric heat strip guide, a complete system troubleshooting diagnostic chart, and how to troubleshoot compressors in TXV. Inside is packed with even more information. It performs sizing of both metal and flexible duct. It has the only direct reading conversion from smooth metal to insulation lined metal we've ever seen. The majority of technicians have never been taught that if the insulation is on the inside of the ductwork, you cannot size it with a regular duct calculator. It has step-by-step -step directions for determining airflow through a gas furnace, electric furnace, or an air conditioning unit. It has pressure drop multipliers for ductwork, as well as recommended velocities. And finally, the scanning of this QR code gives instant access to over 100 tutorials to assist the technician with every test and repair imaginable. You owe it to yourself, as well as your customers, to own this tool. It's less than $20, including shipping. The SuperCool will save you countless hours of frustration when troubleshooting units. Log on to our website and get one today, and I promise you will be a better technician tomorrow. And remember, every technician is only as good as their tools. Thanks for watching.